So this is the 2014 Leaving Cert Ordinary Level Paper 1 and we're looking at question number 1. A shopkeeper bought 25 school blazers at 30 euro each and 25 trousers at 20 euro each. Find the total cost to the shopkeeper. Okay, so that's going to be 25 times 30 euro. And that gives us 750. And 25 times the 20 euro for the trousers, which gives us 500. So the total cost will be the addition of those two, and that is 1250 euro, or 1250 euro. Part B, the shopkeeper sells a blazer and a trousers as a set for 89.95. Find her profit on this transaction. Okay, well, a, a set costs her 20 plus 30, which is 50. So if she sells them for 89.95, the profit will be the difference. 89.95 minus the 50, which is 39.95 euro profit. Part C, the shopkeeper sells 22 blazers and blazer and trouser sets at 89.95 each. She sells the remaining three sets at a discount of 20% on the selling price. Find her markup, that's her profit, as a percentage of cost price on the total transaction. Okay, so 22 blazer and trouser sets at 89.95 each. Let's find out that first. So 22 times 89. 95 and that gives us 1978.90 then she sells the remaining three sets at a discount of 20% okay so a discount of 20% 20% off this price well 20% from 100 leaves 80% so we just want to find 89 95. What's 80% of that? So times it by 80% on your calculator or times it by 0 0.80. So that'll give us the discount price for one set and that gives us 71.96. So that's the discount for 20% off. Now there's three of them so we multiply that by three. Gives us 215 88. Okay, so then her total uh, would be the addition of this and this. So if we add 1978 90 plus the three extra pairs of a discount. That gives us a total of 219.478. Okay, so that's how much she got when she sold them. Her profit then will be the 219.478 minus the cost. Now her cost, if you remember from part A, was the 12.50. That's how much it cost her. So her profit then will be 944.78. That's her profit. And they want to find her profit as a percent of cost price. So if we want to express that as a percent of the cost price, we express it as a fraction of the cost price, which was 1250. And to change that to a percentage, you could times it by 100. So that gives us 
an answer, do this in your calculator, an answer of 75.58%. That's your percentage markup. So that's the end of part C and the end of question one.